Welcome to NASDAQ Trade Talks. I'm Jill Malandrino, global markets reporter at NASDAQ. As AI becomes smarter, more human-like, our societies, our economies, and our humanity will undergo the most dramatic changes we've seen since the Industrial Revolution. Dr. Tomas Chamaro Premnusik, Chief Invention, Innovation Officer of Manpower Group, joins me to discuss. Tomas, it's great to have you with us. Welcome to Trade Talks. Thank you for having me. You got it. And will chat GPT replace human work? I don't think so. Not this version, at least. I think we can predict that just like with previous, even disruptive technological innovations, it will eliminate certain tasks, but not all jobs together. And it would, of course, create many new jobs. I mean, three months ago, nobody was talking about being a prompt engineer. And now it's one of the most sought after jobs, if you can be good at that. How does ChatGPT have the potential to reshape the business landscape? Well, I think, you know, the generic kind of a pattern we're seeing across jobs and industries is that it's redefining the meaning of human expertise from having all the answers to questions to actually asking the right questions from, uh, you know, providing correct answers to vetting whether the insights provided by generative AI are correct. And of course, from acting smartly, making wise decisions on the basis of the information that we get. So in general, we see huge potential to replace mundane, low value activities and tasks and free humans for more creative and intellectual activities, which of course doesn't mean we're automatically going to jump on it. We have to make sure that we actually motivate ourselves to deploy our creativity and curiosity in this age of generative AI. As AI becomes smarter, more human-like, our societies and economies and our humanity are really going to under, um, undergo dramatic changes. And to your point earlier, more so than we've seen since the Industrial Revolution, what do you expect to see? We expect to see short-term disruption and a lot of uncertainty, but positive long-term changes where actually humans have access to more creative and intellectually fulfilling activities. And where, of course, we find ways to demonstrate our values through the tasks that AI cannot do. This will likely involve things to do with emotional intelligence as opposed to IQ. I think AI will win the IQ battle, but EQ will remain a quintessentially human endeavor. So things like empathy, consideration, caring about each other, there will be a lot of need for human and humane validation in an age in which so much of our time is spent interacting with machines. How is Manpower Group leveraging AI for recruiting? Look, our recruiters have jumped on ChatGPT. They love it. I mean, a lot of the tasks they do, writing emails, the parsing through resumes, uh, improving job ads, are quite standardized and predictable. So they're using ChatGPT for that, which of course frees them up to manage clients and candidates. They can spend more time on human and humane activities, such as helping clients understand what they need, which is not always what they want, and also advising our candidates, our job seekers, on what jobs and careers are good for them. Things that really require you know, a human touch and cannot be automated or done by AI. Do you think it removes some of the personalization from it? Tomas, I receive hundreds of pitches a day, right? From different agencies where they want to pitch their guests on my show. And you could tell when they're form letters, you could tell they don't understand my show, that the guest doesn't make sense for the different verticals that we cover. Do you think it's going to remove the personalization from recruiting as an example? Look, I think it's going to actually uh, push us humans to provide something that has a human touch. In a way, you know, ChatGPT is the intellectual equivalent to fast food. It might give you a fast fix. It might be, you know, cheap, easy to get, but maybe not the most nutritious thing for your hungry mind. So look at it in the same way that elevator music or elevator art works. You know, it has an eliminated uh, social proof. It has made it more important and it has pushed humans to demonstrate their expertise, not in the form of competing with AI, but using AI in order to augment, augment their skills and provide something that can actually push the boundaries of creativity and imagination. Okay, Tomas, we appreciate the insight. Thanks for joining us on Trade Talks. I'm Jill Malentrino, Global Markets Reporter at NASDAQ. Thank you.